Okay, now you want to start by backing the brakes off by turning this nut on the back side of the slack adjuster counterclockwise until your S cam is in this position. Normally, these rollers will be on this side. You just back it off until this is in the closest possible spot here. Then you pull the drum off like I've got here. And then what you're gonna wanna do is remove these two springs. I just take a screwdriver, pry them off, and then you're gonna pop these loose. Now that they're loose, you just pull this down off to the side. And then your shoes come off. We got our new shoes, we got our hardware kit. We'll start by setting these in place like so. To install these, smack. They're loose, they're held in place there. I go ahead and pop these on. Some people put these on after they put them on the truck. The round part goes in the half circle there, this clip. A little harder to do this one handed. This clip goes in here, locks into this hole here. These here go right here. Personally, when I do these, I try to take them out. You just You beat them with the hammer if they're stuck like these ones are. As long as they're not excessively worn, I just leave them. Uh, I feel personally that excessive heating and beating on these things is kind of a uh, point of diminishing returns uh, until they get worn. If they're already stuck and they're not worn too bad, I just reuse them. Uh, once they start getting uh, Getting worn into the surface where the shoe rides on here, uh, I'll go ahead and I'll put the oxyacetylene torch on here and I'll heat them up and beat on them until I get them out of there and then I'll replace them. Uh, these ones I'm just going to roll with for right now. They're they're seized in there. When you put new ones in, slather them things up with anti-seize. Uh, it'll make your life a lot better in the future. Uh, but anyway, let's start putting these shoes on. I start by hooking this large spring on the two hooks that we just beat in there. I start with the top shoe. Top shoe's in place. I push down on the bottom shoe. Get it so it slides into that S cam there and just pull down on the other side. And now they're on there. Next we're going to install the two smaller springs. I hook one side in like this, take my screwdriver, go through the loop of the spring, through the hole that it goes into, pry it down, and that's in there.
do the other side. Brakes are installed. Next we're gonna slide the drum on. I've got the trailer aired up and the brakes released and we're gonna adjust the brakes here real quick. Then we're just gonna back it off a quarter of a turn. like that. They're dragged just a tiny bit, but I prefer to set them up a little bit tight when you first put a new pair of shoes on. Uh, an old pair of shoes, a half a turn, normally about right. Anyway, I hope this video helped you out, and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Thank you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe below. Have a good one.